First full day. We're going to Animal Kingdom. Yes! Got my Grogu hat. <laughs> So the reason why I've done this here is to do a cheeky outfit of the day. So we've got these stitches on. Hello. Okay. May as well do your outfit of the day as well. I got a Epcot t-shirt. Start from the top. You got Grogu hat on. Okay, Grogu hat on. There we go. T-shirts. I've got this one. I got at Orlando Airport last year, which has got tour dates. Tour dates on the back. Oh, I can't, don't know if you can see that. But there you go. Canada t-shirt for you. Yeah, from Epcot. And we've both got cool shorts on. I've got daisies. Flamingos. Ooh, flamingos. And shoe wise, I've got these doo -doo -doo Adidas trainers. Uh, these I'll be wearing them every day probably. <laughs> Let's go. We're still figuring out how um, the hotel is laid out. Because um, we're over in Trinidad, which is where the uh, refurbished rooms are. There we go. Refurbished rooms are. Um, but we're trying to find the station to get our mugs refilled. The one closest to us is actually in the building that's being refurbished right now. So that's why we can't go there. We have to go all the way to the back. But it was quite close to the bus station. Oh, there's spyglass. Maybe we can refill there. But yeah, I love this. It's crazy. It's February and I'm wearing shorts. So we've got a while to our bus and look, there's little turtles on the beach. It's so cute. And there is the gorgeous Skyliner looking pretty but we're not taking that because we're off to Animal Kingdom and we've arrived there's the tree of life looking so pretty <gasps> oh it's so cool being here we've already done our first photo pass just outside the park and yeah now we're here oh can't believe it so excited <laughs> so we have just picked up a little bit of breakfast you've got a Mickey Bicky and I'm just finding my mum. Yay! Who has? I remember. Yeah. That's huge. Who has my colossal cinnamon roll, which is actually. Oh. Yeah, it, it's big. <laughs> the Mickey Bicky. Mickey Bicky, as we say. So this was five forty nine. That was seven ninety nine. Five ninety nine. Um, this one. Five ninety nine. Yeah, and then it went to six something with the tax. With tax. So oh, I yeah. we're gonna eat these and then go on the safari. That cinnamon roll was amazing. It's the same one, and pretty much as you get in the Starbucks. But I got it from Kusafiri's Coffee and Bakery, Coffee Shop and Bakery. No wait at all. And Starbucks had a super long queue. And that's from Zuri Sweet Shop. So, yeah. Right, let's go. We're getting in the safari. Tell me it's finger like. It gives them the ability to reach out and grab leaves off the of trees, kind of like you're grabbing them with your hand. For from the white rhino that we may get lucky and see later. These are Nile hippopotamus here on the right on the riverbank, as well as in the water here on the left. Nile hippos are actually poor swimmers. The walker glide across the bottom of whatever body of water they're in. Long. That's the same size as the average height of a man, anywhere from about 500 to 900 pounds. And they can see are black with white stripes, and you can tell by looking at their noses because their noses are black. They're one of the only species of zebra whose stripes don't extend to their full bodies. Their underbellies are still white. A group of zebra is called a dazzle. Over here on the left are African painted dogs. Their tongues are purple. It helps prevent sunburn on the savanna. A group of giraffe is called a tower. <laughs> The giraffe only sleep for a total of about 30 minutes every day. They sleep in one to two minute power naps spread throughout the day. They actually sleep standing up. So as you can imagine, it takes a lot of effort for a giraffe to lay down. They really only lay down if they know they're not in any imminent danger and don't feel threatened. 
So there's a giraffe just blocking us and they've brought out the big guns and um, <laughs> to try and get her out of her way and it seems to work, she's facing the food um, but yeah, that's the situation right now <laughs> <laughs> so we're still here. Apparently, this giraffe um, did the same thing on Disney Plus. So it's a famous giraffe. It worked! <laughs> on the right, we'll get a little bit closer look here in just a second. May they suffer from habitat loss due to the mining of Colton. Colton's a mineral that's found in small. Greater flamingo are the lightest colored pink of the flamingo species. They get that pink color from the shrimp and grill they eat that provides beta carotene in their eye. Because if they hunt at night, we give a better chance for large predators to chase them. They do their hunting primarily at night because their vision improves three times to what it is during the day. The females in the bride walk to hunt, and the males step out to take care of the territory and the cubs. So if you're walking in the park later and you think you hear a lion roar, it probably is the lion. They can be heard all the way from the parking lot. Look here on reserve. Oldest baby, he turned two in October. Little baby, he turned one in September. My name's Russell. I am a wilderness explorer. <laughs> so, Safari's wicked. Yes, that was cool. I mean, it was obviously took quite a while longer because we were stuck behind a giraffe for so long. What was it called? A giraffic jam. A giraffic jam. Yeah, I was like, tower? <laughs> Just like there was one! Yeah. yeah, we were stuck in a giraffe jam, which was uh, totally fine. <laughs> so, really cool, and obviously the supports had to come out. So we are just heading to... My favourite ride in Animal Kingdom. Expedition Everest. Everest. Oh my goodness. So we got the front row. It was super good. Hey, how you doing? Oh, I'm Bye. over here. Yeah. So, super fun. Yeah, done the expedition Everest. Love that ride. And now we are on our way to Finding Nemo. Oh, that's what we're doing next. Cool. Yeah, we're going to do the show. We've still got it's 12 o'clock it starts. Half hour till it starts. But uh, yeah, if we start getting ourselves a spot now, then we're going. Watch it, it'll be lovely. This is new for us, oh. so I'm looking forward to that. Yeah. Hello. So we'll just oh. whack you in the bar and have a cup of oh. well. I don't know now. We're sat in the bubble zone. <laughs> I love that it's called the bubble zone. So we're just waiting for it to start. It should be 12 o'clock, they said, and it is now 53, so 7 minutes. 7 minutes until we watch this. So, loved Finding Nemo. What did you think? That was really cool. That was your first time seeing it. How cool is um, sort of the, Crush like, when yes, he comes up? Crush was cool. The and and the what a tune. As well, yes, it, like, really, really cool. So, we're just going to go and do Dinosaur. Because, yeah. why not? I don't remember this ride. Yeah. Last time. I'm, soon, I'm sure as soon as I get one, I'll remember. So, so good. I'm looking forward to it. It's, uh, Good weather. Yeah, it's picked up really nice now. Yeah, I mean it's meant to rain. But, um, yeah. <laughs> Love this ride.
As you've probably just seen, yeah. we met Chip and Dale. Chip and Dale dressed as dinosaurs, <laughs> and we the also Chipmunkosaurus is the sign. Yes. We also met Daisy. Daisy, and I'll put a picture in here. That was really, really cool. Daisy um, liked your shorts. She did, because they've got daisies yeah. on them. <laughs> Didn't even think of that. I was like, oh yeah. Anyway, we're going to try and find our way back to Pandora. We haven't been to yet this trip, because it's obviously the first day. And um, we're going to go and eat, because we are. It's the Tuli Canteen once again. Yes. That is oh, so my favourite food place in Apple Kingdom. So good. But I actually don't know where we're going. We could be going. I say favorite food, food place. I think that's like literally the only place I've eaten. Yeah, yeah because you literally had that. Because it was so three good that meal when I had it. I was like, I just want it again. It's really um, like refreshing for super hot days. Yeah. Which thankfully this isn't. Yeah. Nice. It's lovely though. And we're here in Pandora. You can immediately tell from the sound. Think we're gonna try and find a photo pass photographer. So we can get a picture with the other oh, floating yeah. islands, which <laughs> never get old. Oh my goodness. It's crazy. Yeah. Gorgeous. So we've come to Satuli Canteen, which is not only gorgeous looking, but the food's amazing, and I'll show you that now. So this is my combination bowl, which is beef and chicken with noodles, and I've got the green onion vinaigrette, which looks lovely. Elliot has the hearty salad with chicken, which looks so good. And my mum over here has got, again, combination bowl salad with the herby green dressing. So we're going to eat these, and we got some ice water as well. Lovely! Okay, <laughs> right. This was a bad idea, it's very busy. <laughs> anyway, hey. So we haven't, we didn't even say we were going on Flight of Passage. Oh, didn't we? No, the oh, last oh. thing we did was show the food at Satuli. Which was incredible, <laughs> as expected. Food in Pandora, going the best way. Yes, I didn't vlog any of it, not even the queue, not even nothing. I was just like, let's just enjoy the ride. Amazing. Oh, he's got hey hey boots neck t-shirt. <laughs> Top to t-shirt. Anyway, so we just did. We need to go to Africa. So we just did. did the flight of passage. My mum wasn't feeling too good after Expedition Everest this morning. She was like, one big ride a day. One big ride a day. So she just skipped that out. She's gone to see the Up Bird. Not, it's not Up Bird Show anymore. It's just Bird Show. So we're just gonna go meet her. Oh my God. It's mind blowing. Absolutely mind blowing. Just as good as I remember. Oh, bucket so much. But yeah. You've been eyeing it up since before we got here. I've been eyeing it up since they released it last year at the Festival of the Arts. And then I saw that they're doing it again this year. It wasn't only there last year, when we No, it's only for Festival of the Arts. So and I was like but you did I want get the orange bird cup. Uh, I'm gonna come around all the festivals and get the novelty food and drink things that I have no use for at home but look cool on a shelf. But anyway. Launch by McQuack! Oh, there's somebody else on that Yo! <laughs> yeah, there's Launch by McQuack. Scrooge. And Scrooge McDuck. McDuck. Top tier. Anyway. <laughs> As expected. Oh, on the boat. Oh, look, there's more! Oh! Pocahontas and Miko. It is. I mean, I'm going to show you, obviously. <laughs> Hello. That was awesome. Pocahontas and Miko. 
Which, incidentally, you need to really re-watch that because I don't think... So I was just trying to find that. No, they're both. I've never seen that one. You said you haven't seen that since you were a kid. No, I didn't like it as a kid. Yeah, I, I can see why, but I think, I think you'd like it now. I didn't like you didn't Mulan as a kid either, but then we rewatched watched that so a couple good. of years ago and I really liked it. And the live action was pretty decent. Yeah. Oh, I like the live action Mulan. Oh, but it didn't have the live yeah. action Mushu. It didn't have Mulan. Live action Eddie Murphy. Love Mushu. But anyway, need to rewatch watch Pocahontas yeah. is a long short of that. Yeah. And um, yeah, flight pass is good. What's next? Yeah, don't know. We'll find out and we'll tell you. So we started moving and then. Um, Hello, Magic. Anyway. So we just saw Mickey and Minnie on their little boat and um, and Pluto and they were uh, had uh, the Magic is Calling playing which top tier song and yeah lovely time so we're just gonna go and reunite with Mama and uh, see what's next because we don't even know so we just went to drink Walla and we got I got a frozen Jack Daniels and Coke slush love so, they had Captain Morgan's as well which I'm kind of tempted to get next time. I got the ham dipped Mickey premium bar and yeah I'm very excited to eat it so we stayed out of here for not very long About 10 minutes. after having that ice cream and um, Elliot having his uh, Jack Daniels and Coke situation we've come back to Pandora to go on Navi River Navi River journey hey. but um, enjoy that while I uh, show you the floating thingies there you go ta-da we're hoping that it will get dark while we're in here, which given that it's 105 minutes, I think it might. We're gonna have a little deliberate because is it worth 105 minutes? But either way, we wanna come see this all when it's dark. 110, it's just gone up to 110. Yeah, change of plan, we're not that hardcore. We're not um, gonna wait two hours for that. We're coming back here later in the trip, so we're thinking maybe hit that first. Thing. Yeah, like literally, leg it, do that. Because I mean, flight of passage, we, it said 75 when we got there. It was an hour and we were on and we were, that's literally a fab. The fruits of more are a fruit bar. That's a fab without chocolate. Yeah. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> so, it's just not worth it for us. I'm sure other people would say you're crazy that's a really good amount of time to wait for that but um there's just other stuff we want to do and uh so we're gonna go and do those things i think what is it dino land yeah we're gonna, gonna walk there? about dino land for a bit we're gonna do it. it's tough to be a bug because why not so it's tough to be a bug delivered on the scaring children again <laughs> it's quite freaky yeah it is you always forget how dark it is and then like hopper comes out and it's all the bit about how like humans kill bugs and you're like this is quite it's like dumb. a taste of your own medicine with the sprays and yeah sword. i mean it's still the, good the spiders coming from the sea yeah like, i remember that but yeah we're off to dino land to have a look around there this area is so cool it's quite busy compared to how it was this morning i've got tunes playing as well yeah so we just did something super cool we just did the little dino um, photo booth. Seven dollars if you want to buy like three strips. But it's just this little photo booth here. Wait, where is it? Oh, there. Ta-da! Yeah. <laughs> really good. Anyway, now I think Elliot's going to try and win me a plushie. You want one, so I'm going to try and win. Yay! Did you win me something? Unfortunately not. No. Close. Close, but... Close, but no cigar. Oh. That was the one we went on. It was the little... Little plastic balls yes. thrown into the little rubber circles. They were very bouncy and had a mind of their own. No, not quite. Oh, it did travel a lot. Yeah, that is. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Guess who won? I won some more win. I want some more Mickey as well, but I've got some Mickey. 
She's got her little Dino Institute thing. Yeah, there's no one of focus, but. And then oh, she's she got is. Animal Kingdom on her little foot. <laughs> and it was six dollars for four goes, and we had two goes, so we paid twelve. But yeah. I got one, that's what's important. This is the time of year we came last year, we didn't actually get to see Pandora at night. So we're here to see Pandora at night. And also Minnie's never seen it before, so <laughs> she's, she, you know, she's been stuck over in Dino Land, so. She's probably heard all the noises. Yeah, it's time for her to see it for herself. Cool. And also you. Little, little I'll be honest, I'm many excited for you to see this. So here we go, Pandora at night. Oh. The camera is not doing this justice, I can tell you that much for nothing. It's gorgeous. All the little lights and sort of UV stuff and oh, light up sticks, it's amazing. Hello. Everything looks so gorgeous and we've just noticed that our Magic Van Pluses is doing this. How gorgeous. <laughs> I mean, look. How gorgeous. Love walking through the parks at night. I mean, obviously, Pandora is the best bit at night in this park, but just everywhere where it's so pretty when it's lit up. And we haven't even got to the Tree of Life yet. Good evening, friends. Look around you. There is a special magic that flows through this land. The magic of nature. Pulsating with fireflies made more brilliant by the light that lives within you. Tonight, as we gather together under the branches of the tree of life, our luminosity ignites the magic to create a beacon, shining out and celebrating 50 years of the most magical place on earth. The beacons of magic were a thing, so that was a pleasant surprise. Yeah, wicked. Literally, such good timing. We were, yeah, we were contemplating like, oh, do we uh, go on like um, Navi River Journey? Do we have a look around some other bits? What do we do? I think we made the right choice. And we were like, yeah. But we were like, ah, let's get back to the hotel so we can actually look around the lobby and stuff that we didn't obviously get to do last night because we wanted to make Phantasmic. Rushed away. Yeah. And we literally got there. We're like, what's the crowd for? Let's just get in it. And within two minutes it started and it was wicked. So we're just waiting at bus stop number 14. The only one waiting for our bus. So far. Let's go get our stuff and go to Sebastian's Bistro for dinner. That is a nice hotel. We had a snoop last year. 
Also, Saratoga Springs had a snooper around there. Oh, I like that. That's so sad. Yeah. Anyway, wait for this bus and go. So in case you're wondering about the menu, this is it here. So you've got, well that's the, the sort of family style stuff and then a plant-based bit on the end there with the dessert, the beverages and a little Sebastian there. So there you go. And then we've got the cocktail list just here with all your beers, ciders and all of that at the end there. So lovely. So we've just had the water brought over and this is the little coaster. Sebastian's Bistro on the other side says Banana Cabana. But that's the side. It's so cool, isn't it? But yeah, big fan. This is the decor. We've got lovely little chandeliers and windows that look out onto the, I'm guessing water? I think water. So here is our salad. It looks really nice, really good. None of us have had that anymore. Um, I had any of that yet, but um, the same can't be said with bread, but I will still show you. So we've got guava jam, and that's the butter. It's got some sort of fruit, I can't remember exactly, sort of infused with it. Lovely. And these are the little bread rolls, and they are so warm, fluffy, almost brioche. No complaints so far. So good. Yeah. Even Saucy McNo Saucerson is. I had a bit of the bar. Yeah. The second bar is right. Yeah, but you tried them and you said they were good. For you to say anything that is not sat under a heater and had all the moisture that was ever in it sucked out of it. Yeah, that sauce. I'm gonna like barbecue and sweet chili. So for you to say it was all right, that's that's good. So here we go, sangria McGee. Carib what? Caribbean sangria. It's basically sangria and rum. <laughs> I have a hoist the colours which has got guava, mango, rum, lemonade, pomegranate, yumminess so I like it. So more food has arrived. We've got some broccoli there, vegetable curry which smells incredible and some rice and cilantro beef. rice and beans and here we've got some chicken. The pork pork with like a mango sauce and some steak. Mmm. Yum 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 yum. And then Sebastian. Well, just finished up in Sebastian's and thoughts? Yeah, it was good, other than the pudding, just the record in, but dinner well, was lovely. I mean the ice cream you enjoyed. I had the ice cream. And did you enjoy the caramel sauce? Can't compare with caramel. And I don't mind bread pudding, a bit too much coconut for me because I'm not a big coconut person. But um, my mum enjoyed that and oh, but the rest of the food was class. We've gone the wrong way. Anyway, steak. Top tier. Chicken. Top tier. Pulled pork. The best. You didn't have any but mango, top tier. Ah, uh, mango chop. Oh, so good. Um, the rice you really enjoyed. Yeah, kidney beans and some some other rice. I it's called, but it was really nice. Cilantro rice. Um, really nice. The the broccoli. Oh, the broccoli was good, and the veg curry was good. Yeah, I enjoyed that. So, just a list of the bread, the salad. I the bread. Anyway, we're very full, so we're going to waddle over to our rooms and just pretty much go to bed. Once yeah. But it was a good day. And we got a really exciting day tomorrow because we're going to Magic Kingdom. We won't actually be able to show you most of our day because we're doing Magic Kingdom. Yeah. Probably gonna be a short vlog then. Yeah. So uh but please stick around even though it's gonna be short. <laughs> I promise I'll tell you all about it.
<laughs> the vlog's just gonna be, we're going to Keys to the Kingdom, we went to Keys to the Kingdom, it was really good, we're doing the fireworks, we're going to bed. Yeah. That's probably gonna be the, the next episode. It's, um, we'll try and do a lot, and we'll try and tell you everything that we can, without spoiling it for anyone who's going to do it, or... Yeah, neither of us have ever done all it. the secrets. Neither of us have ever done it, so yeah. that should be quite fun. So excited. It's been on my, like, Disney bucket list for years, so... To finally do it inside. But anyway, back to this vlog. <laughs> We're going to bed. Yes. So, like and subscribe, please, yeah. if you enjoyed and if you want to see more. Because um, there will be more. Yeah. And, um, good night! Bye.